Today I'm going to give you five tips to stay warmer in cold weather. So I'm going to give you five tips to stay warmer while sleeping in cold weather, but before I do that, I want to let you know this is a collaboration video with nine other YouTubing backpacking channels throughout the United States and Canada. So let me get to the list. I had to write it down because there's so many of them. All great channels. Check them all out. All great people, all doing different things around the country. So first off is going to be Rob R. Pelton 1. Second person on that list is Dan Becker. Third is Devin from Backcountry Exposure. Fourth is Amy Rout. Fifth is Joe from Hiker Joe. Sixth is Maddie from Maddie Outdoors. Seventh is Jeremy from The Purposeful Life. Eighth is Jesse from Backcountry Forward. Check out all those channels. It'll be great to see how they're staying warm in other parts of the country. Just a little background on where I'm from. I live in Southern California where luckily we get some real mild winters. Most of the time in the winter, we can hike around in shorts. Lows at nights are getting to around low 30s, high 20s, but every once in a while we get into single digits. And just this past weekend, we get our first snowstorm in California, or in Southern California, and our local mountains, which I can see from my backyard, are covered in snow. Well, number one is I layer appropriately. This right here is just some base layers I use. This are my bottoms. They're just a fleece. They keep me nice and warm. They're a nice lightweight fleece. I also do that for my top as well. So I got top and bottom base layers. Sometimes when it's really cold out, um, say it's getting into single digits or in the teens, I bring this out with me, a little face mask. And there you go. And just enough that it covers my face. It's got a nice fleece inside as well, fleece lined. This keeps me warm at night. So first thing I do is layer appropriately. The number two thing that I do to stay warm in colder weather is bring a Mylar blanket. This Mylar blanket here is, I believe that SOS brand, and it's a little bit thicker than other Mylar blankets, but weighs nothing. It's orange on one side, it's got the silver Mylar on the other side to reflect body heat. And the reason I go with this one, the orange, I can use for signaling uh, search and rescue just in case of an emergency. But this one has lasted me, I don't know, probably three years so far. Goes with me on almost every trip. Like I said before, it weighs nothing. I can stuff it in the bottom of my pack or maybe where the hydration sleeve is. Goes in there, but this will go down at the bottom of my tent. Everything else goes on top on the inside. And if it gets really cold, I can bring that over and throw it over on top of me and it'll just reflect that body heat right back. Number three on my list is this right here. It is my z -Light pad, but no, this isn't the only thing I sleep with. I put this down and then I pair it with another sleeping pad that usually has a higher R value, say above a four, usually 4.5, 4.7, somewhere in there I believe my sleeping pad is. And that keeps me warm at night and this is just another layer of protection against that cold. My number four tip on how to sleep warmer in cold weather are thick socks. These socks go with me on every camping and backpacking trip I do in cold weather. They keep my feet nice and warm. I know I could go a little bit lighter by using the down booties, but I prefer these socks and they've worked for me for years. One thing I do before I go to bed at night is make sure my feet are dry. I make sure I don't have my old socks on that I've been sweating in throughout the day, but I let my feet dry. Then I'll put these on and they keep my feet toasty. My fifth and final tip for you on sleeping warmer in cold weather are hand warmers. This one here is a super warmer. I also use the regular hand warmers as well. Um, each night when I'm sleeping out there, when it's cold out, I'll throw one by my feet, one by my torso. Underneath a sleeping bag or in a quilt, they work great and they will keep you warm, especially by your feet. Your feet will be nice and toasty. So get yourself some hand warmers and put them in your bag. You'll be warm. So those were my five tips on how I stay warm in cold weather. What are your tips? How you stay warm out there in colder weather? I know some people like to use a bottle that they warm up throughout the night and they'll do that a couple times throughout the night to stay warm. That's just not for me, but yeah, leave your tips down below on how you stay warm and don't forget to check out those other nine channels that this collaboration is with. I've got links below to all their channels. Check them all out. All great people, all good channels. So until the next one, thanks for having me. Man, I gotta get out of this. This is just way too hot. I gotta add on this.